Hello. Um, I guess for introductions, my name's Chris, and this is my first time ever doing a vlog. And I have to say I'm pretty excited. Now, I'm going to try and do this for a little while, because, well, a lot of people tell me I should do journals, or, you know, express myself. I kind of always had a hard time with it, because I, I don't do music, or I don't really find myself very expressionable. Except my faces, my voices, or just how I act in general. But other than that, I only have like a music or a drawing touch. I mean, I cook, but that's just another thing. But it's really nice just to do this off the bat. Well, like I said, my name's Chris, and for the first time, for the first video, what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and learn the piano a little bit, play some music. Uh, granted, this is also my first time trying to learn the piano, so this is not only my first video, it's also my first piano tryout, and this is also my first time putting myself out there for all of you. So this, this should actually be a lot of fun. Um, what do I have to tell you about myself? Well, I collect comics. <laughs> I cook, and I live in Westchester right now, and I have to tell you, life isn't so bad. I like it. I mean, just like anyone else, I have my ups and downs, my left and rights, my wombly wobblies, my flippity floppities. If you want to say what I'm trying to say, I guess you can look over there to the poster and you can figure it out. I'm a little bit, a little bit of a Doctor Who fan as well. I'll show you in other videos, my whole house is basically almost covered in posters of things I love. Some people have said, Chris, I can't believe you have made a shrine in your own home of things you love. I'm like, how couldn't you do that? Why wouldn't you do that? You know, if you live there, if you look at the walls every single day, why not make it to things you love? Things you're interested in, things that have made you cry. Laugh. Memories. Something that reminds you from fourth grade when you had a random dinner with someone that you'll never meet again, but just having that simple memory for a second brings a smile to your face. Why not have those correlations with things? And that's why I kind of like putting up my stuff up in my own home. Um, let's see now. Other than that, I love video games. When I was growing up, I had an original NES system. Actually, no, I take that back. My first system was an Atari 2600. Now, granted, I'll tell you right now, I'm 25 years old. And that is an old system. That's like the grandpappy of game systems. And I remember back in my day, I really can't say that too. I remember back in my day when I used to just take the video games out of like these big bags that had zippers on them. And you would just take the games out, blow them, blow on them, and they were bigger and thicker than a Nintendo cartridge, I tell you what, and you know for a fact, if you're kind of as old as I am, maybe even a bit younger, you've had a blow into a cartridge of two, and those things, eh, you can say those things were a bit, they weren't that bad blow them into, then again, I was kind of a kid, I was kind of always running around, I was always full of breath, or hot breath, I was always yelling, I mean, what kid wasn't? Now, I'm going to try and play here, it's a really classic Disney song. You're going to see me kind of going like this, because I don't know how to move to put my fingers, but, oh come on, if you know this song, you, you know Aladdin, and even if you don't know Aladdin, you probably know this song, and if you just don't know this song, and you don't know Aladdin, where the fuck have you been? I also find it a little bit more calming and soothing to talk to you as I do this. It keeps me active. Now, now tonight, when I originally like started doing all this, I tried to start playing the guitar. Now, I found it really, really hard to play this thing. I mean, it's just positioning your fingers and pressing them at uh, uh, the, like, the right point. Uh, maybe it's because the guitar is big, 
my cousin Johnny. Shout out to you, Johnny. But I gotta say, when I use this guitar, it's just it's just a little hard. Maybe I just gotta get used to it. But I would just love to play an instrument, a guitar, definitely. I mean, who doesn't love good old time rock and roll? Bob Seger, right at you. But I don't. I mean, other than the piano and the guitar, one other like instrument I would just love to play is a uh, it's a saxophone. Oh God. If you can just like blow and wail on one of those damn things. If I can hear a horn sing to me, it's like magical. Like remember remember the back days of like Louis Armstrong or even um there's that George Michael song that like I think it's Careless Whisper that like if you hear it you just know some like like something's coming. And I ain't talking about weather. <laughs> Ah, uh, no, but I'm 25 years old, I live in Yonkers right now, and I gotta tell you, life's, life's actually pretty good. People are good to me, I got, fan, I got friends and family that love me, check up on me, it feels good. Right now I just can't sleep, I'm up. Hands free. I'm playing. Oh, so, uh, but I gotta say though is that I'm really hopeless for this to become a regular thing, and I know it really kind of comes down to me to to really be doing it. But when I do, I know I'm gonna look forward to. I know I'm gonna look forward to it every single day. Maybe I'll at least one of these twice a week, three times a week. I haven't really decided yet. This is just kind of like the base to start. And if I can have a good time right now, which I'm sure I will, but even, maybe even more, who knows? There might be days where I'm sad. There's going to be days where I'm fucking hyperactively happy. But, but that's what the point of this is for. And then maybe I'll learn something along the way. And maybe so can you. Until then, this is my first video, and this goes out to all the ones that love me, care for me, and really think I can actually proceed into the future. Let this be to the beginning of a good start. Love you guys. Take care. Have a great day.